don't make this mistake with hydrogen bonding. I'm going to talk about what is probably the biggest misunderstanding, misconception about hydrogen bonding so that you will never make this mistake yourself. Imagine this is a question on a test or something like that. And you're given the structure of this molecule. And the question says, show, hydrogen, show the hydrogen bonds in this molecule. And so somebody circles this O and H here, and they say this. This right here shows the hydrogen bonds. Is this right or not? It is not right. It's not right at all. And here's why. Hydrogen bonds are intermolecular attractions, which mean that they happen between molecules. So in order to show a hydrogen bond, what we'd have to do is get another molecule and show an attraction like this. And the, the attraction, the hydrogen bond, is going to happen between this O here and this H here. And why is that? It's going to happen because in this bond, in this molecule, which is a covalent bond, it links these two atoms together, the oxygen is a little bit greedy. We, we call that electronegative. It's more electronegative. And so what it does is it hogs the electrons in this direction. So because it's hogging those electrons, it gets a little bit of a negative charge. And so we can show that little bit of a negative charge with this lowercase delta sign with a negative. And since it's, hiding, since it's hogging the electrons away from the hydrogen, the hydrogen gets a little bit of a positive charge. And the same thing happens on this molecule down here. The oxygen is hogging, so it gets a little bit of a negative charge, and the hydrogen is getting the electrons stolen away from it, so it gets a little bit of a positive charge. The hydrogen bond forms between these two molecules when the positively charged hydrogen on this molecule gets attracted to the negatively charged oxygen on this molecule. Remember that opposite charges attract. So almost just like magnets, this guy is going to float over here and the hydrogen here is going to become attracted to the oxygen and they're going to form this attraction is going to form a hydrogen bond. Sometimes hydrogen bonds are drawn by a series of dots or a series of dashes, just like this, between the, hydro the positively charged hydrogen of one molecule and the negatively charged atom of another molecule. So these lines here show the hydrogen bond between these two molecules. This bond here is not a hydrogen bond. Yeah, there's a hydrogen in it, but it's not a hydrogen bond. It is a covalent bond that exists within this molecule. Hydrogen bonds happen between two or more separate molecules.